came away from his fruit wine. Uh, from the berries that grow around here, wild berries and the cultivated berries. And uh, we decided that we thought we could probably sell it. Grow our own elderberries because, well, we can't get a wild one. So we've got our, our own elderberry plantation here. And we use the berries and we use the flowers as well, you name it. Black currants, red currants, rhubarb, gooseberries, all sorts, whatever grows. Different fruits get different treatment. But you, generally what happens is they come in here um, and they get chopped up or minced up and they're usually blended with uh, a sugar, sugar a syrup. We make what I call a fruity soup, sweet fruity soup out of the, uh, in the fresh berries that come in and then we put the yeast in so it's kind of uh, just the same as traditional great wine making you create a fruity juice and put in a yeast and the yeast converts the sugars into alcohol and then it's kept over a year with various stages of settling and filtration and you keep it for a year before it gets a final sterile filtration and bottled.